Hello game hunters, Neolus here with Monster Hunter World. Last time we started an expedition, found this location to build a camp, but it is plagued by a cool Yaku, and now we have to go hunt the little Cretan. So let's get right into it and find its trail so we can capture it. Or, you know, kill it because I don't have any traps. I am being targeted by something, or at least I'm in a fighting. You see that red ring around the map? That kind of means that I'm being seen by monsters. And I think it is a Kuluyaku, but I'm not entirely sure. I'm going the wrong way, I think. Let me let me check the map actually. So you can see right here that's a mining outcrop. And holy shit. I need to watch out because there's an anginath running about. Okay, so here is the anginath. And I'm somewhere around here. The Kuliaku. Okay, I found him. And right here, you can actually set uh, which monster to focus on. So I'm gonna focus on the Kuliaku, if I can. Right, okay, it's on the top of the thingy. So now my bugs will fly to him and not to Anginath. So if uh, also traces, if I find traces, uh, the bugs will automatically go after Kuluyaku first. Not sure if I'm explaining all of this right, but you you get the picture. I mean, you're smart people. Smarter than me. I'm a fucking moron. I just found a trace. I am wondering what the fuck is targeting me because I don't see anything. There's no small monsters. Am I just seeing things or? Oh, fucking hell. So my bugs won't come out because something's targeting me. I'm in fight mode, so to speak. So whenever I find a trace, I have to pick it up myself. I have to focus on the floor. What the fuck is targeting me? You know what? I think I have a simple solution to this. I just have to find a bush. Now don't tell me there's no fucking bushes around. Maybe there's a, a, a flaw in the system or something, I don't know. There must be something wrong because... I'm pretty sure nothing is following me. Let's try this. Could you shut your yap, please? I guess it's not working. Oh well, I can see the Kuloyaku, so I'll just go to him. That was the Kuluyaku, right? Where's he fucking going? He's pretty fast, isn't he? What the... Okay, now I can actually... Use my bugs again. I, I don't know what the hell went wrong there. Oh, 
All right, Kuluyaku, are you up here? Here he is. Sup, bruh? Let me slash your heels for a second. Oh, and he dropped his little pot thing. There you go. Slash his tail. Not gonna help. Uh, I don't think his tail is cuttable. He's a small monster, so... Usually that that is only possible with larger monsters like Raffalos and stuff. Mm. There might be some breakables, like his uh, feathers and his head. But I don't know, I've only fought one Yulu, Yulu, Kulu, Kuluyaku before. And I have no details on him on the on the hunter list or hunter notes. That was a dumb idea. Whoop. Don't you fucking throw your rock at me, dude. And that's that's what this rock does, right? If you're in front of him and you attack him, it just he just deflects your attack with that rock. And he can also you know, use it to smack you with Come on, bruh. Drop your rock. There you go. No, 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 no. So I want to be... With duels, I want to be at his sides or his back at all times. Unless, you know, he drops his rock. Then I want to hit his head as much as possible. He's kind of slow, uh, you know, he's one of the beginning monsters, so he's not too hard. You just have to watch out for his, you know, jump uh, rock smash thing. And just uh, keep wailing on him until he dies. And dodge his uh, attacks, of course. Oh, I did not mean to do that. I think his rock is gone. Yeah, it is. He'll pick up a new one. I think I broke his feathers, and now he's not targeted, uh, targeting me anymore. So I think he's going to run away. Yep, he is. So uh, I'm going to pick up these wall drawings because I think they lead me to something later on. Large doodles. All right. They're gone. Okay. And some bones for uh, upgrading the bone weapons that I have. I made three dual blades. Uh, three bone dual blades. I still need to upgrade them, and later on I can get uh, an, a water weapon, an, an electric weapon, and I th think it was a fire weapon, but I'm not entirely sure on that. I these weapons I'm keeping them because I'm gonna need them. Uh, these duels, I am going to upgrade into the water version uh, for Anjaneth. I did get spoiled a little bit, a bit, and uh, it appears that Anjanath is weak to water, so I did get spoiled a little on that. And now I'm spoiling everyone who hasn't played Monster Hunter World yet. Sorry. All right, you run away, you fool. Where's where's my bugs going? There we go. So yeah, these blades, I know they can uh, be upgraded into a water, uh, I was going to say affinity, but it's not affinity, it's, uh, you know, the, the water, they, they have water weapon. Attribute, that's it, they have water, water attribute. So... And I know it's better than the bone one, so I'm going to keep it. 
Oh shit, I didn't know he could do that. And he just dig dug out a rock from the ground. Piece of shit. Oh well. He bounced off. So you don't want to attack the rock. Unless, you know, you know it's gonna drop it. I didn't know that. I didn't know you could, you know, actually knock it out of his hands. I never seen it before. I think he's kind of weak, or at least hungry. I saw him drooling, so... That usually indicated the monsters are pretty tired and they won't attack very much, or, you know... I haven't seen him limping though. See, he he is tired because he's not doing much. I still want to be careful because you never know. And I guess he's running away again. Just my luck because there's a bone pile here and I want to get it. Alright, let's move on. I didn't see him limp. Or I missed it. Yeah, it's a good idea. I wasn't paying attention to my, uh, you see there under my health bar and then under that is the yellow bar, the green bar is the health bar, the bar under that is the stamina. It runs out when I press the R1 button to run or you know when you dodge or do the demon mode stuff and underneath that is a, is a little sword, a green sword. When that's red your sharpness is all the way down so your weapons do less damage. Now, if you're familiar with Monster Hunter, you would know that. But if you're a new player, that's something you gotta uh, take take care of. It also causes your weapon to become blunt, so you bounce off of monsters more often when you don't have sharpness. Like uh, what I was doing against that rock, you know, and just bounce back. What the fuck is he doing? Are you a shark? You circling me, you piece of shit? Ah, shit. That wasn't good. His plumage is all gone on his head. It's all destroyed. Poor animal. Oh, shit. I should have said that. <laughs> he took offense to that. He actually takes a blocking stance as well. That's pretty neat. Like this animal evolved into using defensive techniques. It's pretty awesome. Oh, come on. I want to fucking ride you, piece of crap. Stay down there so I can jump on you. Ah, shit. Oh, that was close. Come on, dude. What the fuck is this red stuff he keeps dropping? Oh. Could you fucking go off the ledge so I can jump on you? Please, fine, I have duels. I can't fucking jump. Go off the ledge. Come on. Right here. Come here. Yes. Fuck you, piece of crap. Ah, shit. Would you... Cat, lead him up here. If You know what? He is getting me pissed. 
and he ran away so no no riding today nope I could have killed him already what the hell are you doing bro are you running that way now you're running that way do you even know what you want this animal retard is he stealing eggs oh my god he's actually eating an egg that he just found in his nest or whatever ah crap well it wasn't too bad Come on, could you fucking go down already? Jesus, the great Jaguars went down faster than this. I, th I was comparing the great Jaguars to another monster from Monster Hunter 3 and I thought I just remembered his name but then I lost it again. What was it? Now I'm now I'm constantly thinking about it too. Oh my god. You know the the sponge monster Ludroth. That's it. The royal Ludroth. That's what he reminded me of. There we go. Could he fucking die already? Holy crap, dude. All right. I guess I did it and now I get him in a quest as well so I can farm him if I want to but I'm not going to because it's a hunting quest uh, you have to capture him and I do not have the needed materials to make traps and nets and you know uh, the What was it called again? You know, the, you need you need a trap and the oh, I fucking. I played Monster Hunter for years, and I still keep forgetting names of certain things. But that's just me. Um, there we go, Astera. I can't go. I guess it's because I'm in. Uh, In a fight? Where are the fucking monsters though? Where you assholes off to? This thing again, I swear to Christ, like in the beginning of the quest. Oh, there they are. You cunts. Piss off. Oh, look. Uh, the... The T-Rex guy just fucked off. I lost its trail. So he's not in the map. Uh, he's not on the map anymore. Could you f guys please fuck off so I can leave? Thank you. Cunts. I need to uh, upgrade my weapon, dude. Yeah, see? He's gone. And the Kuliaku, of course, his trace is still there, but uh, he's dead. What I could do is go around and pick up some items and uh, pick up some trails, but I can do that off screen, no problem. I have time enough for that. But uh, let's go back to Astera. There we go. And I guess we go to the trade yard. There we go. Thanks for making sure the campsite is safe. We went ahead and got the camp all set up. It's yours to use as you like. And now that I know you've made oh, what you're made of out of five. And now, 
that I know what you're made of, Fiverr. I hope I can talk you into taking jobs from me more often. All right, that's it. Um, I'm going to cut it right here. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below what you thought. And uh, I hope to see you guys in the next video. Leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Bye.